Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Right now I'm filming kind of a series of wedding dress try-ons from affordable wedding dress companies. Um, and today I'm gonna to be reviewing a wedding dress from Mod Cloth, a store that I've really loved for a really long time. Uh, they sell all kinds of unique vintage type dresses and some of the dresses they sell are wedding dresses or can be worn as wedding dresses. So I got a wedding dress and a pair of shoes from them. So I'll be telling you all about that today and doing a little try on. So be sure to watch this video till the end. And then if you decide that Mod Cloth is not the wedding dress company for you, don't worry. Um, if you still want an affordable wedding dress, I made a video that compares Mod Cloth with Lulu's, with ASOS, with Amazon, and a couple of other dress companies all in one video, dresses under $300. So after you watch this, be sure and check that video out. I'll link it below. Uh, my name is Brittany. I write for WayfaringWeddings.com. I'm planning my own wedding right now and sort of uh, making videos about what I learn in wedding world right here on YouTube. If you like this kind of stuff, make sure and subscribe um, and like this video. All right, let's get right into it. So here is my box from Mod Cloth. Have not opened it yet. I'm very excited to do that. So the dress I bought is called Back in the Daisies Mini Dress. I thought it would be interesting to get a short dress for once. Um, so yep, yeah. and I got it in a size eight. So I usually get like a size six or eight. Um, and yeah, I, I get mediums in most dresses that I buy. Um, I'm 5'7", 140 pounds. So if you're in this range, that might give you um, an idea here. Oh, this is really cute. <laughs> Oh, this is really, really cute. I really like this. So yeah, like I said, um, Mod Cloth tends to have vintage, um, just like super unique stuff on their website. And these sleeves are so freaking cool, even cooler than I thought they were gonna be. Let me see if I can get sort of a close up here. So beautiful. They're like tiny sequins. Ah, that's so cool. <laughs> Um, I also really love um, like any kind of vintagey looking wedding dresses, 50s, 60s, 70s wedding dresses. So of course I'm excited about this. Um, all right, so we'll try this on in just a second. There's also some really cool buttons. Ah, love the, I'm obsessed with these sleeves. <laughs> okay, and the shoes that I got are um, kind of like a something blue. That's the idea here. Here is the shoe. Ah, these are really cool. They're, I think they're like, they're a good five or six inches, these heels. Again, kind of vintagey. I got a size eight. Um, we'll see if they fit me. I'm usually about an eight, eight and a half in, in shoes, US size. <laughs> and the shoes are called the Refreshed Zest T-Strap Heel and they were about $40, $39.90. The dress was $151.20, and then I had to pay $58.07 for duties, taxes, and fees, and then the shipping was free. Um, so it kind of did add up, especially with the duties and taxes, but I live internationally. I live in Vancouver, so I think I just had to pay more because of that. It delivers within two weeks, so it came pretty quickly. And then the return policy is that you can return anything within 30 days of the day the items were shipped. Something I also like about Mod Cloth is that they give discounts to teachers, um, students, and military, and then they, they have some other discounts as well, so be sure to check that out before buying. Okay, time to try this stuff on. All right guys, so here's the dress. Um, you'll see that, I mean, I feel like this is not a super popular style with the, the shoulders kind of being poofy um, because people tell me all the time they don't like this like football player effect, I guess, <laughs> whatever you wanna call it, um, which is like maybe a little bit 80s or early 90s. Um, but I'm a weirdo and I do like this, like, like kind of boxy, looks on on women and i just think um i don't know for whatever reason i like it and it's also sort of unique i never see wedding dresses like this with daisies on the sleeves sequin daisies it is a lot of fabric so you'll see it's it's quite substantial there's like a, a fair bit of room in here <laughs> but to me that just makes it cooler i like it a lot
and then it has this square neckline which I've also talked about in the past I like this square or V neckline I think they're both really cool and so everything else about this dress is really plain other than the sleeves the sleeves are really like the cool interesting part of it I would say the rest is pretty simple uh, you can definitely wear a bra with this the straps are all would all be hidden um, and then the bottom is just like really simple it definitely needs to be steamed I'm seeing like wrinkles here in the Sun uh, and it's just like it's just a short dress so I think this is probably a polyester material really simple um, with these lines uh, which makes it kind of slimming I guess in some, some regards. I'm wearing the blue heels with it which I'll try to get a close-up on in just a second. This kind of dress I think would be perfect for like a casual wedding, something that's not really formal, maybe a courthouse wedding or something outside, a backyard wedding. Um, if you just want to throw back and have something really cute and playful and vintagey, I would go with something like this from Mod Cloth. Right now I want you to check out a video I made of affordable wedding dresses from not only Mod Cloth, but Blush Fashion, Lulu's, ASOS, Nordstrom, uh, Amazon. I made a video where I bought dresses from all of these companies and I compared them to each other to find the best, most affordable, most awesome dress online. So if you like this video, make sure and check out that one as well. Um, and good luck wedding dress shopping. Don't buy an expensive dress just because you feel like you have to. There are so many other great affordable and often eco-friendly options out there. So shop around, uh, find something that suits you and that is convenient um, and cheap. Good luck everybody. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel.